I mean, this week, you're all Americans. <laughs> Now, this is a bit of a problem for people like us who speak English. <laughs> we can converse perfectly well in a shop or a restaurant, but when it comes to cars and motoring, every single word you use is different. When I say different, I mean wrong. <laughs> when you change gear with a lever, what do you call that? <laughs> stick. Do you see, this is a stick. <laughs> You couldn't change gear with this, it wouldn't work. What you can do with this is point at things, okay? Let's just see if we can get you educated. What do you call this bit of a car? <laughs> bonnet. Then learning. It's a bo what do you mean? No, I know you can wear a bonnet on your head as well. It's two things. <laughs> We're capable of having those different thoughts. <laughs> now, what type of vehicle is this? <laughs> no, it's stupid. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> another let's do another one of these. What type of vehicle is this? <laughs> coop. A coop is where you keep your chickens. <laughs> that's a coupe. That's a French word, I admit. Yeah, a bit. But, and they're muddled with that. George Bush, you heard what he once said about the French? He said the trouble with the French is they have no word for entrepreneur. <laughs> <laughs> it is difficult. I think the only thing we agree on is steering wheel. Yeah. But then they go and put it on the wrong side of the car. <laughs> it must be really annoying having to drive along like that all the time. <laughs> Why don't you just put it in front of the driver like we do? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs>